hello everyone uh, in this video i am going to share about uh, how to create such box in uh, joomla 5 custom component uh, we will uh, add a search box in this page and and we can search from this name description etc uh, we are working like uh, go to content articles here you can see we are going to create the search box like this uh, here we can search for example article 1 and click on search icon it will show the result uh, i will share about how to create like that search box and uh, how now we can add such methods and in our uh, model view controller so that we can get a uh, results before you start this lesson uh, you must have the basic knowledge of joomla 5 custom component and and the basic knowledge of model view controller if you are not familiar with Joomla component development and and about the basic of model view controller, uh, you can easily learn from this link mynphp.com Joomla 5 extension that you, you can learn from this link. There are many chapters step by step explaining about uh, Joomla component development joomla module development and uh, more, uh, an introduction of model view controller and how, how we can create read update delete data from database in our custom component now uh, you can learn the basic of uh, component development and from this link from this website so uh, you must have the basic knowledge of the component development uh, to learn this lesson uh, let's go to our code file here yeah, this is my my view file this is my model file uh, we are working on event list so in the event list model i retrieve the data uh, from the database and in this view.html.php it retrieve the data from the model and show in this duffer.php this html view here you can see this is the course for this ui the code for table and form yes, and it shows the data from the database of events that we retrieve in the model file so you know, I request you to learn about the basic of component development so that you, know, you can and learn this lesson and you, you will understand this lesson so, so in in the in this course I retrieve the data uh, from the database and show in this view now I'm going to add the form in the search box uh, in this view file and and we have to change some codes to get uh, to get the search result from the database mm -hmm so first of all we have to create the search box so in this duffer.php view file uh, we have to create a search box so let's start writing codes first uh, you have uh, you have to take care about the search box should be under the form inside the form 
so that when we search uh, it will submit the form uh, like Joomla, Joomla methods uh, to search uh, results and return and you have to add the search box inside the form this is the course for uh, this table retrieving data yeah uh, above the uh, this data table let's add a search box Let's give the class as row margin bottom three let's give as column three and input group class let's create an input box for text and give the name as filter search and you can give the ID also filter search and its value will be echo is dot as escape now this is the format of writing the text that we retrieve from the model view filter dot search after that close the php tag and in the next line let's give this input box as some UI so that some um, see bootstrap pleasure so that it look like looks good so give the form control class and give the placeholder as such uh, if you are using multi language uh, you can use the language values also uh, how to use the language value uh, in uh, multiple language uh, you can easily learn from the previous uh, websites I described to you after input box let's give a button search button and the form will be submit so I request you to add inside the form Let's give us the VTN class and VTN primary. There will be a search icon, so I will give the icon search class. Now let's run our site here yeah, you can see the search box now we created the search box and uh, added the search icon now our search box is ready here yeah, we added the value as like this because uh, when we search from this and 
and submit the form and the value will be the search search key for example if i search for article 2 and submit the search box uh, it will refresh the page and and get the result of article 2 but uh, there is article 2 value in the search box this mean uh, this is the result of article 2 so we are retrieving the data uh, from the search filter search and at in the input box so that if we search event one and click on this button and the page refresh and and give the result and it will show which key we search so we add the value this in the search box it will get the search key and add in the button now our search box is ready now uh, we have to filter the search results from our model uh, here in the model I retrieve the data from the database I retrieve select star select all from this table now we have to add the codes for uh, uh, we have to retrieve only the uh, data uh, that is match when the search key so we have to write the course for filter search in this query now let's retrieve the data of, uh, from the search key get state filter dot search we are retrieving the search key which is the key the user added and the next step is first we have to write the popular state function and that retrieves the search key and uh, we have to write the search codes that retrieve from the database in the get list query function so in the populate state function create a function populate function the prototype function populate states and give ordering and direction so oh, in which direction we we will show in which order we will show the data in our view in this populate state function get battery get application and get the search key input and get the string of filter such that we give a one we created when we created the input box now we give the name as filter such so we are getting that filter such and give this like this and the next step is let's set the state as filter dot search and pass the value of search now it will retrieve the data from the filter search if this is empty it will retrieve empty string and the next step is parent populate state and ordering and direction
if we create um, the filter methods for you know, like this filter options it also uh, we have to add the codes for uh, filter uh, like the uh, if we create sorry if we create the publish and publish we also have to write here for the publish and publish and uh, now we are working on only such so i will write the codes for only such methods and after that let's continue to search from the database and uh, we retrieve the data from the get state filter to search now in this function uh, we receive the search key that the user search now the next step is uh, let's write if the search key is not empty if it is not empty let's retrieve the data first uh, it will retrieve uh, all the data from the database of this table db code and uh, now we are writing the and the codes for for the key that match when the data in the table you will understand after some few codes and give this as true query the query that we retrieve from the database and now we are where event type event title uh, they are event title event description event creator date I like that feel in in this in this table now if we go to our database here uh, to calendar events they are event title event description event start date etc so i am writing for that yeah event title like like mean uh, it, it it match uh, when the search key so add this search key the key that user enter in the form or oh, we are uh, searching for two uh, event title and event description uh, if the search key is match with event title uh, it also so show the result uh, otherwise if it is match with event description it also it also show the result so if we want to search only when event title you don't need to add this event description it is also like with if it is match with the search key In this uh, in this file what we do uh, we get the search key that the user enter and uh, filter the search key that mm, that is match with event title and event description in the database now it passed the search result data to the view file and it will show uh, in our table view uh, it retrieve the data from the model and show 
in this tuffo.php now we have written the course for such method now let's try to search it is working or not so let's search for event 1 and we'll click on search now it will show the result of event 1 and we'll search for event 2 yeah it is showing event 2 now you can see why I added uh, this value here if I search event 2 if, for example event 3 and click on this submit button it will refresh the page and show the data of event 3 but the value of the input box will be and its value will be here you can see filter dot search this means uh, this is the search results of event 3 so we added the value here the value in the input box and here you can also see uh, it is a submit button and it submits and refresh the uh, page and it refresh the data but it gets to this page if I refresh this here you can see if I search event 1 and, and click on submit button it it works on this page the same page so the URL will not change the URL will be the same why we are getting this let's try to check our code let's check where it does error yeah it should not have space save and run again and let's search for event 1 now you can see now we have successfully created the search function search box and search function so that we can search in our Joomla 5 custom component so thank you very much for your attention